So, who here likes believes in science? Raise your hand. Okay. And who here believes in magic? <laughs> As you can see, like, science, you can prove stuff with it, like how the moon is over there, now like inside the earth ring. But then magic, you have a hard time because when you, like magicians, they just take out stuff out of their bunnies, out of their hats, or top hats, of their of cane, suit, something like that. But when you're a scientist, you can, it doesn't really matter what you take out your shirt or something. It matters um, when, what you create. Like, do you create life? Or do you like find a new species or something? Or maybe you like make a chemical that does weird stuff. Or something interesting like that. Magicians. They just take stuff out of their like thing, I don't know, whatever place they hide it, <laughs> in your box. And they earn money like that. But scientists, they just work and work and work on something. And until they find a new thing, their work takes a long time. So like magicians. They could just put a bunny in a box and then open the front window or something like that. It's like, oh, it's gone. <laughs> <laughs> but then, and then, and then this person signing is like, science person, it's like, there's a mirror in the box. Lying. <laughs> <laughs> so then he probably does like another trick, like, a steel wall right here. I'm gonna go through it. So he puts up a curtain. And then you just, and they see him wiggling around, and then he just summon, and then he puts it down, and he's past it. It's like, yes, I went through a wall. And then um, they replay it, it's like, he just has a camera right here, and then he's actually just walking around it, and you can hurt him. <laughs> like, who does that? You don't hurt anything, like... And so mission, Magician tries again, because he, he doesn't want to fail and be, like, bankrupt. And so he gets like he's in a so he puts himself in a box and he says, I'm gonna escape it. So then he just puts up a, a curtain, another one, it's always red. And so he when he then he when the curtain comes down, he's gone. Where do you think he's gone? Do you think he came out and did a magic trick? Or did he actually just steal the scientist's money because he didn't want to lose or something? No. And then, as you can tell, he thinks that robbing is easy. <laughs> Little do you know that scientist hides GPS tracking devices in his money. And so when he goes home, the police barge in and say, freeze! And then, and then he raises it and then he gets like arrested because he stole money from the scientist. So that's how scientists got back at him. And he learned to not um, steal money again. <laughs> and then scientist, um, joy with his work, said, thanks. <laughs> and then he walked home. He got his the money from the, rock, the bank um, magician. But then he forgot there's GPS in his device. So when he came back home, he's coming to freeze. He's like, wait, wait, I was the one who had this money. And he's like, nope, it's the one that's GPS. But it's my money. And I'm still going to jail because it had because it's not because he just took it. Like, no. <laughs> and then he went to jail. Yeah. So that's why some people think science and magic are the same or different. But they're probably the same because they both go to jail. <laughs> <laughs>